tonight for being on time. Thank you to all of you who were on time today. Let's see. Let's see, Marissa's not in here anymore. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Let's get your starter out. I don't have a starter. So what do you do if you don't have a starter? Yeah, I'm starter. I don't have yours, but I can get you a new one. Okay. I know. I'm just saying. Can Maybe. I have one? Yes, you can. The PBS 4 to 1 strategy is that for every one corrective statement I might make, um, for instance, saying, um, Michael, will you please get out your paper? I'll follow it up with four positive statements. So maybe saying, thank you for getting your paper out or thank you for getting your pencil out. And then throughout the period, I'll continue those positive statements. Thank you, Elmer, for working on your starter. Thank you, Jace. Ladies, thank you. Five seconds, finish up your last thought. Okay, thank you guys so much for being quiet. That was amazing. A duplicate of that something. That was an awesome answer. Jace, what did he say again? I heard you say it too. A duplicate. A duplicate. Thank you, Jace. So a duplicate of something. Now a positive statement to me, a positive statement is is praising the child or the student for something they did that was correct, that was following my expectation or my procedure. So anything I see that follows an expectation, I'm going to acknowledge it and I'm gonna make a positive statement regarding it. So, hey, Michael, thank you so much for doing your starter. Thank you so much for following the procedure of working on your starter. Somebody knows this in here. Raise your hand if you can tell me what replication means. You take an old song, you make it new again. You take pieces of the old song, but you kind of change it up. That's not necessarily DNA replication. We're making an exact copy of it. Okay? Thank you for that input, Jace. Um, look at me go. Thank you, Matthew. Thank you for raising your hand. That's perfect. Thank you, Alejandro. Thank you, Yesenia. Thank you for getting paper out, Jose. Okay, thank you to those of you who got your paper out. I'm gonna, I'll come give it to you, Serena. Um, here is Let's see, notes look awesome. Good job. Thank you for putting your name, period, and date, Yesenia. Okay. Okay, during notes, make sure your girls are writing, not talking, okay? Just make sure you're getting your notes. All right. Um, do you need paper? A corrective statement is a statement where a behavior, I'd like to correct the behavior. So if, you know, Johnny's sitting at his table and he doesn't have his starter out, my statement would be, hey, Johnny, can you get your, your starter out for me? And then when he gets it out, I'd follow it up with Johnny. Thank you for getting your starter out. I'm pretty sure I think I saw most of you. I didn't check the sides, but all my people. <laughs> I want to thank you guys for keeping your phones away and not touching them. I will be. I am going to ask for everyone's participation in this, but you don't have to do it way up here. Matthew, eyes up here. You don't have to do it way up here. So if you might, you might as well practice it now. High five. I like that statement. Good job. Okay. So step one. Extra credit points. I'm willing to give you five. <laughs> Jace, we're going to center ourselves. Five extra credit points. Ready? Step one, show me. Everybody that does this, get five extra credit points. Do it small or do it big? Show me step one. Step one. Step one. This whole side, you guys are, you guys are, ki you're killing it. Okay. Step two. Show me step two. What are we doing? Step three. Okay, you guys are awesome. Okay, two, ready? Five, four, three, two. Good job. And use it to the other side. Good question. Thank you for raising your hand, Matthew. 
So we're never going to have, well, if it, yeah, okay, so if it stays old, if it never replicates, it'll stay all one color. That's a great question. So it would just all stay blue. Thank you, Brian. Thank you for raising your hand. They don't add new nucleotides? That's a great question. What happens if I don't have any DNA, DNA polymerase? Okay. Okay. So watch your language. You need to pass this down, please. I did. He already has. Oh. Okay. So what word did you say that I don't like? I have this. Shit. Yeah. So can you think of a different word instead of shit? Give me multiple. So you have two. Here. So when I make both a corrective statement and a positive statement, I try to keep my voice tone the same because, uh, especially in a corrective statement, I don't want my voice tone to be elevated because that can bring up some emotion in the, the student. And so I try to keep myself very calm and whatever the statement may be and not have them react emotionally. Kind of my energy will kind of feed off of their energy. Sheet, which I have made myself. So make sure you are checking your notes. Why did you throw that? You know better. I had to give it back. Is that how we give it back? No. How, what's a better way we could have done that? Getting up you, and handing it to him? Yes, ask oh. me first, right? Okay. So you know better. So next time, what Don't are you going to do? Away. Yeah, thank you. So one through four is your homework. So Daphne, what's your homework? Thank you. Problems one, one through four. Serena, what's your homework? Problems one through four. Brian. When I started doing PBIS, um, it did. It was a little unnatural because I. Don't, as a teacher, I expected students to get a pencil out and get paper out. And when they didn't do it, I was kind of thrown for a loop. So, but so really trying hard to focus on praising a child when they get the paper and pencil out, it's, it kind of uplifts my day. Instead of coming from a place of corrective behavior and, and correcting my student, I come from a place of positivity and it makes me feel better. It, brings my room environment to a place of positivity, and then my kids want to come to my class. And I think PBIS is a big reason why they want to come to my class every day. In the basket. Okay. Then you get cancer. Well, cancer is a type of mutation. You guys can go. Thank you for waiting, you guys. You may go. Um, if you miss a nucleotide.